10 News at 6 starts right now. Six years ago, Nancy Harris was having back pain. Her doctor suggested that she take up walking to kind of build up her strength. She and her friends took that diagnosis to the extreme. Ted News reporter Bobby Lewis back out on the road in South Tampa where friends are helping carry one another through life's peaks and the valleys. <laughs> How far do you think we should be going? <laughs> the first word that comes to mind when walking the streets of South Tampa probably isn't rigorous. Yes. But this <laughs> is more than just a leisurely stroll. This is a little more realistic. It's training. I love this group. These are my sisters, my hiking sisters. Nancy Harris, Brenda Trainer, Elizabeth Harris, and Jennifer Baldwin. Four friends, five mountains. These are serious treks, which, you know, is what we want. We want a challenge. The challenges started with Nancy conquering Kilimanjaro in 2010, then trips to Mont Blanc, Everest Base Camp, then coast to coast in Corsica in Europe, building bonds with every step. We were crossing rivers uh, with rainstorms so that the water was really high. Every single day was hard. Every single day was a challenge. You're only there because you got yourself there. On the trip we had a motto that was something like I'd rather feel exhausted than disappointed. So even though it was killing us that day, we, we would have been disappointed if we didn't finish it. The views from the top of the world are memories they won't forget. But the bonds they formed and tested on Earth's highest peaks may be more memorable. That it's not if you fall, it's how you get up. Absolutely. Our first trip was just a tease. Oh. I can't wait to go on to the next trip. Set for 2017 in the Bhutan Mountains, another chance to see what's important in the world. I think appreciation more than anything, gratitude, sort of puts things in perspective. On the road in Tampa, I'm Bobby Lewis, 10 News, WTSP. And Nancy has pledged to raise money for Academy Prep School in Tampa by accepting donations before her hikes. It's a great school. Since 2010, she's been able to give the school, get this, over 40 thousand dollars.